Nicole. Okay. Here goes nothing. I can't believe I'm about to do this. Taylor. Hi Nicole. Thanks so much for meeting me. I'm excited to catch up. Nicole. Hi Taylor. It's so great to see you. Um, listen. There's actually something I wanted to talk to you about. Nicole. I don't really know how to say this, but I've heard some rumors that you've been spending a lot of time with Travis Kels, the Kansas City Chiefs tight end. Taylor. Oh, wow. I'm impressed you heard about that. Yes. Travis and I have been seeing each other casually for the past few months. Nicole. Well, the thing is, I'm starting to get concerned. I know you've had a history of high-profile relationships that have ended poorly, and I'm worried this one might go down a similar path. Taylor. What do you mean? Travis and I have been very careful to keep things low-key and private. I don't understand why you're concerned. Nicole. It's just that. Well, you have such a huge platform. Taylor, anything you do is going to be under intense scrutiny. And with Travis being a professional athlete, I'm worried the media attention and pressure could really take a toll on your mental health. Taylor, my mental health. What are you getting at? Nicole, Nicole, look, I don't mean to overstep, but I've noticed you've seemed a little anxious and on edge lately. And I can't help but wonder if this new relationship is contributing to that in some way. Taylor, I... I didn't realize it was that noticeable. I've been trying to keep it together, but the truth is, I've been feeling a lot of pressure lately. The album, the tour, the relationship, it's all just been a lot to handle. Nicole, I'm so sorry, Taylor. I can only imagine how overwhelming it must feel. That's why I wanted to talk to you about this. I care about you, and I don't want to see you struggle. Taylor, I appreciate that, Nicole. Honestly, it's been hard. There have been times when I've felt completely overwhelmed and anxious. I've been trying to put on a brave face, but deep down, I'm really struggling. Nicole, I can only imagine. And that's why I wanted to bring this up, because I think it might be time to take a step back from this relationship with Travis. Taylor, what? You want me to end things with Travis? Nicole, I don't mean to tell you what to do, Taylor. But I'm worried that this relationship could be adding unnecessary stress to your life right now. Maybe it would be better to focus on your own well-being and take a break from dating for a little while. Taylor, I, I don't know. Travis has been a source of comfort and support for me during this crazy time. I don't know if I'm ready to let that go. Nicole, I understand. Taylor, but think about it, you've been through so much in the public eye. Isn't it time to put yourself first for a change? Taylor, you know, you're right, Nicole. I need to start prioritizing my own mental health and well-being. As much as I care about Travis, I think you're right that it might be time to take a step back from this relationship. Nicole, I'm so glad you're willing to consider that. Taylor, I know it can't be an easy decision, but I really believe it's the best thing for you right now. Taylor, you're a good friend. Nicole, I'm grateful to have someone like you in my life who's willing to be honest with me, even when it's difficult. Nicole, I'll always be here for you, Taylor, and I know that with time and focus on your well-being, you'll come out of this stronger than ever. Taylor, thank you, Nicole, I'm ready to start putting myself first. It's time for me to take a break and focus on my mental health.